So, I've had this idea for a mobile app and it's been on my uh, to-do list for a very long time and I've just taken uh, a week and a half, maybe stretch it to two weeks off of work to essentially flesh out this idea that I've had for a very long time. And the idea essentially revolves around people like me, uh, other digital nomadic entrepreneurs and people who want to uh, pursue that sort of lifestyle, the sort of traveling and working lifestyle. So for me, I, my experience is two and a half years traveling around the world, working remotely. During that time, I've experienced a lot of pain points and the app that I want to build essentially solves a lot of those pain points. The, I've, I've already come up with a name and it, it, from the name, you'll probably figure out a lot about what the app is going to be and the name I've gone for is is nomad cartography which is a bit of a mouthful I'm not too sure about it entirely just yet maybe it will change um, but that also brings me on to the next point which is I want to record this process and go through the process of building a mobile application in a short time frame or, or at least getting some sort of high fidelity prototype together and share it with the world and get other people's feedback on, on the work that I'm doing. Um, so the idea essentially revolves around help facilitating and streamlining the process for other nomadic entrepreneurs. So for example, every time you go to a new country, um, it, obviously it depends how long you're gonna stay there for, but usually it's anywhere between one month and three months. And during that time frame, you're gonna need some some essential utilities like SIM card, like understanding the transport infrastructure, like understanding how long it's going to take to get from one place to another, what's safe, what's not safe, neighborhoods, uh, best coffee shops, best places to go for co-working and, and, and things of that nature. So what I want to create is something very similar to this. I'm in Athens now, just arrived, and the first thing that was given to me is the city guides and they do a great job of explaining the metro system and all of the historical sites and for normal tourists who come here for holiday this is great this is like perfect exactly what you need and in fact there are loads of these yeah i, I mean these this is what i've picked up on my way to the airport and what's been left in in this airbnb so there's loads and loads and loads of stuff. Um, but what I want to create is something very similar to like a city guide, but for nomadic entrepreneurs. I want it to be telling you the utilities that you need, like SIM card, like transport, like uh, climate, and, and all these different types of things, and visas. Um, just to highlight one of the pain points that I consistently have with um, with SIM cards, for example. So this is my, my SIM card collection. This is the sort of problem, sorts of problems that you have as a nomadic entrepreneur that most people don't realize. 21 different SIM cards. I have a gift gaff SIM card for the UK. If I lose that, it's game over because I have two-factor authentication for particular banking apps and particular yeah bank providers. So if I lose that SIM card, 
it's I'm in big trouble um, so that's something that you need to think about as well but anyway in terms of this project um, I guess the way that I want to to start it off is by essentially brainstorming a lot of these ideas and a lot of these pain points and trying to create solutions for those pain points um, but first I need to kind of have a bit of a brain fart and, and kind of put some ideas on a whiteboard and, and sort of take it from there. So let, let's, let's give that a try. So I've ended up creating this data map which is um, pretty extensive. I'm not going to bother going through it uh, into too much detail because um, I will link it in the description below so you can take a look yourself if you're actually interested to learn about the sorts of things that I'm thinking about. Um, this whole data set is, a, is universally applicable to any top nomad location so when you look at for example um, SIM card and then you go through telecom provider, prepaid data cost and how to top up. That is universally applicable for everywhere that you go in the world. You're going to need those things. So I expect an, to design a feature that when you arrive somewhere in a new destination, as soon as you step foot off that plane and you put your phone off of airplane mode, you're going to receive a notification which tells you this piece of information. And I want this app to be unambiguous. I want it to be completely correct in 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 current times so for example you can find this information online but it's usually discombobulated across very unuseful user interfaces and on on really obscure websites where you got to really dig down i want this to be like in your face as soon as you get off the plane i want this app to be the first app that you open and the first app that you interact with every time you go to a new destination and I want it to be offline so you don't have to connect to airport Wi-Fi in order to to find out this information because at that point it's you know it, it's, you're already going then through that pain point of time you just don't want to hang around in the airport at three o'clock in the morning um, and and trying to find out how to buy a sim card so that's essentially it for today um, I kind of yeah, fed up of doing this now. So uh, tomorrow I'm gonna pick this back up. I'm gonna go through this with a fresh mindset, take a look at everything, and then uh, maybe go through the process of creating some flows and trying to create an idea of a minimal viable product. So something which is actually obtainable um, in the time frame that I've got. Um, and just try and think about how all of this is gonna fit together into one simple app and uh, maybe look at some inspiration and things like that but yeah before I go it would be great though to get some of your feedback so if you're watching this and it's the first video you've ever watched of me uh, it's the first time you've ever clicked on my YouTube videos I would really really appreciate it. I'm not interested if you subscribe or like what I'm interested in is hearing your thoughts if they're positive or negative it would be great to get both a positive and a negative one if you've if you've got time and um, just to give me feedback because this is the whole primary purpose of uh yeah why i'm doing this and maybe you've got a, a better idea idea for for the name of the app or maybe you've got some tips or tricks or better ways of of doing you know creating apps and, and a much better way to do to do what i've done so far so anyway that's it for today i will uh i will catch you tomorrow peace Take our bodies higher and higher and higher